So this is the dialogue. Ram's, Ram asks. And Ram, even though he became this glorious avatar, he still was a student during this dialogue. So he says, Holy Sir, how can ignorance and egotism arise in the self? So if the self is one, if consciousness is everything, where does egotism, how does that come in? How can ignorance come in? If everything is divine consciousness, where does ignorance come in? It's a reasonable question, isn't it? <clears throat> we all ask, how did this happen? If this, all this is Shiva, how did this catastrophe happen? Huh? How did that occur? So Vashishta says, an interesting answer, he says, Ram, one should ask questions concerning reality only, not concerning the unreal. I think that's very sound advice. And, you know, I often say that I'm very fond of questions. You know, questions are a rhetorical statement that actually points awareness at a particular thing. Whenever you ask a question, it focuses on something. What day is today? Immediately, you're, you're not thinking uh, green and red, and, you know, you're thinking day. Today, Tuesday, Wednesday, Friday, whatever. Right? You're thinking day. So out of all the, the possible responses, it focuses on what day is it. Uh, what's the weather like? You focus on weather and so on. So it's a, a very powerful tool of focusing, and we should use questions intelligently because if we ask the wrong question, the focus goes in the wrong direction, and we do it quite indiscriminately. We don't think about it. So, so Vashishta says, ask the right question. Bhavi used to say a disciple should ask the guru the right question. Not like, uh, you know, you know that the old song, Charlie Brown from my youth, why is everybody always picking on me? Why is everybody always picking on me? You know that song? That's a bad question. Of course, what can the answer be? You're a jerk. <coughs> so it's, but uh, the right question would be, oh, master, show me the self. How can I know the self? Ah, very good, my son, do this. So he's saying, don't think about ego, think about the self. Don't ask questions about it. <clears throat> That's very interesting to apply to your, your inner world. Always ask, how can I grow and expand and go towards the self rather than why I'm not there? Because you'll find a lot of reasons why you're not there, why you're a loser and all these things. But that's all you'll get from that. So always ask, how can I uplift myself? How can I get closer to the self? How can I grow in wisdom and joy? Ask those kinds of questions. 